Sir Mike Rake, Chairman of BT Group. What are the key challenges facing the telecommunications sector? Well, I think the, the real challenge is the importance of ICT and telecommunications to society as a whole, to the global economy, to competitiveness, to education, to lifting people out of poverty, to e-government. It's become absolutely critical. It's become more a utility than a luxury. And that's what we have to understand. And that in itself creates challenges. How is BT addressing some of those challenges? Well, I think the challenge, the essential challenge is can we get fast enough? You know, the demand for superpass broadband globally is exponential. Wherever you are in the world, that's what people need and insist upon. So the challenge is to make those investments, get a reasonable return, a fair return over a period of time, and to negotiate very complex and different regulatory environments right the way around the world, which has to be done. You know, the, the, the question, therefore, is having really good systems of interoperability in telecommunications, having a, as much as you can a level playing field for operating across the world and for ensuring that across the world the ICT, the telecommunications providers, are providing what society really needs. What are the key roles for ICTs in achieving some of the Sustainable Development Goals? Well, again, I think if we look at the challenge of the environment, they're enormous. And I think, you know, after a period when perhaps we weren't paying enough attention to the environment politically, it's come right back on track, which is important. And I think these are very complex dynamics. And what's really clear is that ICT has a key role in dealing with this, whether it's smart metering, whether it's efficient use of energy, whether it's recycling, everything comes down to the use of ICT to do this. It also comes down to telecoms companies. BT, for example, you wouldn't necessarily see that, consumes 0.7% of the national grid in the United Kingdom. So telecoms operators themselves have a lot to do in dealing with their machinery, their equipment, the powered units. We all want super fast broadband on fiber. That requires power in a way that copper doesn't. So again, managing those dynamics when you're giving society what it needs and wants and doing that in, a, in an efficient way and an environmentally friendly way and it's, and it's absolutely the core of what BT is trying to do, develop home hubs and machines that switch off when they're not being used, not on standby, makes a huge difference. All of those issues is leading by example, as well as providing a means for others to improve their environmental levels of uh, efficiency and responsibility are really critical.